Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy Poison and Kami here, me, myself and I back at it again with another video. And today's video, I want to discuss a really interesting idea that I actually have. Now, this idea isn't actually fact, nor have I ever heard it confirmed or sort of rumoured or anything like that. It's purely just something I had thought about by myself and I'd like to talk about it with you all. So my idea is that I actually was thinking, since it's all about connections and it's really going through all of the fights from over the different games, from like Storm 2, Storm 3 and stuff, what if, with the theme of connections, they actually brought back styles of play. Now, let me get into this. So, it's safe to say that in each game, like in Generations to Storm 3 to Revolution to Storm 4, each game all have their own style of play, like their own uh, mechanics because of the way you could play in each of those games. Each game was different. So obviously in Storm 2, it wasn't very cancel heavy, but that is like a style in its own. It's very fundamental based, but lacks cancels like dash cancels and animation cancels and stuff. But then Generations was that you could cancel out of tilts. You could jump out of tilts, ninja move out of tilts. You can ninja move into grabs. So you literally go from your tilt into your grab or whatever. Uh, literally how you, what you can do in extra tech Evo is what you can do in Generations back in the day. And then in Storm 3, they had it so you could still ninja move into grabs and stuff and ninja move into tilts, but you could no longer ninja move out of tilts anymore. But then they introduced the relay mechanic. So that is like a style and it's there. Oh, and then the, inf the instant awakening with certain characters. And then in Revolution, when Revolution came out, uh, there was that whole idea of then they took, they made it so you could no longer ninja move into uh, grabs or tilts or anything, but instead you could then have infinite awakening type or Omo Jutsu type or drive type and then change up the style that way. Counters were much longer back then and it was like a whole version, a whole, you know, own version. And then we have Storm 4 as we know it, where you have leader switching as well, on top of like the lack of cancels that we can do, but the leader switching pretty much makes up for it. So my idea was, is that what if you could select the style when you pick your characters? Like you pick your characters and then like another little like option select comes up, something like Storm 2 style, Generation style, Storm 3 style, Revolution style, or Storm 4 style, or Connections is own style because I'm sure connections is going to be introducing their own mechanics and stuff Or they might even find a way to implement their own mechanics within these older styles And then what you do is that when you select these styles you could then play Exactly how you would back then so you could have a generation style player where they could do ninja move out of tilts and ninja move into tilts ninja moves into grabs and stuff all these different ideas of cancels and things and then they can go versus like the revolution player where like they have access to instant awakening mode or omojutsu mode or whatever uh, drive type um the counters are longer maybe like if you think about it it sounds like a really cool and interesting idea but at the same time it, it might also lean to some players picking some styles more than others like if it's like a no rule setting or whatever people might pick revolution style more for the drive type and the counter because the drive type was quite strong with the extra uh, offense and then obviously like the dash cut thing that they had going on back then and then counters were significantly longer back in revolution uh, as they were you know because they give, they give you like a guard break stun or maybe they could introduce the revolution style but then have the counter nerfed because obviously cct wanted the counter from revolution to storm 4 nerfed so they could just have that uh, completely nerfed down or something. But yeah, it was just a short idea that I actually wanted to just relay onto you guys just to get everybody's opinion of is having a style select. Now, I know it is more of like a fever dream or whatever, because like, to be honest, realistically speaking, is like I said, I don't think the styles will be varying much. I think a lot of the old Storm players like myself would be picking Generations or Storm 3 styles. And then the try-hard players would be picking either Storm 4's style or uh, Revolution style. But then actually speaking about it, I guess Storm 4's style wouldn't be too different to the Connection Zone style. Which is then why I said Connection's style would then be uh, integrated with these other ones. So then that would make like Generations go absolutely crazy with the amount of tilt and grab setups you can do with these new like combo pickups that we're seeing and these character traders for Connections. So, um, but yeah, that 
that is some ideas that I want to relay onto you guys there. Just, just some food for thought. Uh, some of you may think the idea is terrible. I can see both sides. I can see why it's a bad idea and I can see why it's a good idea and why it's an interesting idea. I'm sure it could be implemented if it were tweaked and uh, sort of played around with some more. Like with the generation style, yes, you can do infinite tilts and stuff, but then you just have to have it where it, the tilts were exactly like they were in generations and had zero priority versus C dashing. So you could do your infinite Danzo tilt, but it could get dashed through. And then obviously if you pick like the Storm Forward connection style, tilts can still have the priority that they do today. It's just things like that, obviously balancing things uh, so that some things are actually fair. But anyways, that is some food for thought. That is just an idea just to keep the topic of connections going. We haven't had another connections trailer in about a good couple of weeks now. We haven't had any proper news about connections in a couple of weeks. So I always like to think about ideas or talk about connections with you guys through my videos and on the channel and get everybody discussing. Anyways, that is everything I just wanted to talk about. Just a little bit of food for thought for you guys. As always, it's been your boy Poison Akami. Janet.